All right, let's jump into the differences that I've noticed between this and the original Laser Master 3. I'll start with the most obvious ones. The front and the back rail are completely different than the original one. I'll put that up on the screen real quick and you could have a, you know, a, a visual of what that one looks like. The next is the color. The color of this is black and the color of the original Laser Master 3 is a gunmetal gray color. So that's, those are the obvious differences between the two. The other differences that I've noticed are on the front rail of the Laser Master 3 LE, you're only given a power button. On the original one, you're also given a key switch and an emergency stop button. Those are considered the two of the seven safety features of the original one. That's why on this one, the LE version, it's only stated to, get, to have five safety features. The next difference that I've noticed is if you look on the back here, you do not have a switch between the Y axis and the rotary attachment, and there is no plug there for uh, attaching the rotary. So you'll have to disconnect the Y axis stepper wire and connect your rotary that way, like you did, or like you had to do on the original or the older models of the, the Laser Master. The next difference is the speed. This one is stated to have a maximum of 1500 millimeters per minute, whereas the original one is 20,000 millimeters per minute max. Another difference is the way that you tension the X or the Y belt. Um, on the original one, you had uh, you had a piece up here where you would tighten it up at the front. Now on this version, you use a screw. The screws back here, so you loosen these screws up. You adjust the tension and you tighten down the screws. So you'll you'll loosen two screws, one on the side, one on the back. You tighten the one on the back until the tension is cor correct, and then you tighten it. You set it with the the screw on the side. You tighten that down, and it locks in the tension. The X stays the same on the way that you tension that belt. Another difference that I've noticed is on the original one back here you had two extra cables one for z or one that said z and one that said c i'm assuming the z is for the the motorized z axis that they're they've been planning to to release and c might be for a camera or something like that um, it's not included on this so you, you only have your your laser wire here and your um, your x-axis motor wire another thing that's different is because the frame has changed there's no spot to put um, the foldable feet on this so either they need to come out with some other way to lift this up or um, they'll have to be a design to 3D print some kind of uh, adapter to, to put those feet on.